Alright guys, Classic's back with another glitchy combo. <laughs> and this time I'm showing you how to do ultimates that lock on when it's ready to actually hit. So they would even know what to expect. And when I'm doing all these ultimates, you have to stay a distance to where you're still capable of locking onto your enemy. As you can see, I'm still able to keep hitting him and over and over as long as I'm a distance away. And you could be... Try to go as far as you can, like what I'm doing, and then hit them. Because they don't know what the heck you're doing, they just think you're running away. See, like, I could even be inside the building. And surprise them this way. But as long as you're able to lock on, that's the only way it'll work. <laughs> So when you're playing 1v1s, 3v3s, or whatever you're playing, if whoever's enemy's the closest, that's the one you're automatically going to lock on to. So, you know, if you're fighting one guy, if the enemy's coming near you, someone else, that person's going to get hit instead. That's how this weird glitchy way works. And this is the best way to do ultimates without letting your opponents know. So this way you're able to hit them. It's not going to be 100% for some of these. It might be hard depending what they're doing. But certain ones, they're not able to escape very easily. Like Tapion's ultimate and Trunks' ultimate. But yeah, guys, let me know in the comment section below, <laughs> out of all these that I'm showing you, which one's your favorite one? And if you want me to show you some other crazy glitchy moves and combos and other stuff that I know, I got a whole bunch to show you guys. If that's what you want to see, hit me up in the comment section below, and I'll see you guys next time.